Uh, hello guys, today this will be a video about how to spoof Hardware ID because if you got banned on Fortnite and you don't wanna stop to play you can do what I see. So the first step you're gonna wanna go to my s Discord server so the link will be in my bio if I don't forget it this time. So you go to my server and you go on the file channel and you download the first file which is called how well sail this number or anything and you have this file so you close it because you can't use it actually here you have to go to your documents documents yep okay. and you go to downloads and you launch it as an administrator so there we go I accept it okay so there you have it and now you're gonna want to change all disk you have I only have the C disk because uh, Okay, so you change the of four your last digits number, and you replaced it with four uh, hexadecimal. I think that's called like this. It's like digit from one to zero and A B C D A F. So I'm gonna put nine nine and six six. You change, click OK, OK, and you close. The second thing, you click on the second link on the file channel. It will bring you to a media file file. So it's my account, so I can't really download it because I don't have premium, but I will show it so it's on my desktop. So basically it's a Python pi Python whoa, what the fuck? A Python file that allow to allow you to spoof files from cheats and cleans your traces. So you run it and you open it with idle Python. If you haven't have it, you download it. And then you type run and run so then now you can close everything so basically if you want to spoof files you press one so one is spoof two is clean please say hi extra extra so one you press one like this to spoof your files and now it's written down spoofed which means that uh, your file has spoofed and the you if you run a reopen it you can uh, edit as it will run and you basically press like two to clean your files and then it's cleaned so basically very uh, cool so uh, next step you want to go to launch steam because this step is very important so you launch steam and when steam is steam steam is launched you add a non steam game and you add epic game launcher so it's not showing up here because i hardly did have it so you go here you add it and now you play you, you click play so uh, there it is so you close steam you don't have to use anymore so i, I created a new epic account for this video because uh, i don't want to get banned so you Redownload Fauna, you in you uninstall it and you redownload it, but in a different location like your desktop or a uh, NAT drive. So basically, uh, before I had it in program files, uh, and now it's um it's program file uh, sixty f uh, uh, what eighty six or six eight, you know, and it's uh, this file called Voila FDP, so it's inside Fortnite. So. The thing you're gonna do here that is very important, you go to your custom location, you press Fortnite, Fortnite game, binaries, Win64, easy anti cheat, and easy anti cheat setup.exe. You press OK for the administration launch, you click on the button, you wait, and you press end. And now you can play Fortnite, it's basically the end of the tutorial. So if this helps and you enjoy the video, Make sure to like and subscribe. So, um, yeah, that's everything. Goodbye.